morning welcome back to the channel you know what day it is it's obviously the weekend because that's the only time i usually get out and ride y'all so it's almost valentine's day i got on my red thank you queen pep queen pep got me this awesome well she made me this amazing officially snap shirt so i'm very appreciative of her for that thank you thank you thank you if you need anything done make sure you hit her up she can definitely hook you up just like she hooked me up guys today we are doing an event for the fireman and uh miami-dade county guys uh this event is called hearts on fire it's being put on by one of our uh local clubs living free riders and basically what we're going to do is we're going to meet up at the gas station and then we're going to go over to um the fire station it's a fire station somewhere around here i want to say fire station 26 but i might be wrong and i'm only saying 26 because that's what was on the flyer so um i'll get the correct information once we get over to the fire station but anyway we're gonna go and deliver um i think roses i know for sure meals um and just to say you know we appreciate you that you're thought about um you know it was something that they came up with that they wanted to just kind of recognize you know some men that are um you know on on the on in the fire station for valentine's day so again i got my pink on got my red on just kind of representing and the name of the event is called hearts on fire so pretty excited about that i am going to grab some breakfast first i am meeting up with uh, another one of my club brothers and then we are going to go from here so stay tuned Right, we here at breakfast. What we got going on, Q? Um, today we're supposed to have um, Living Free, um, I presume, um, President Ball Blossom, right? Yep. Um, they're having a, I believe what I read was a gift back to the firefighters. Am I right about that? Yes, you oh, are. Okay, you I, are. I didn't know. I, I mean, I just read stuff, y'all, and I look so at you it. So you just got up and just wanted to come yeah, on the ride Yeah, because today. I want to get on the ride. Okay. Now, go ahead. You give me some of them eggs right now, along with some Italian grits. Say Italian grits. Yeah. <laughs> what, excuse me. Yeah. These well done? You want them well? Yeah. Okay. Well, I sure want them. I eat them. Yeah, I want them a little, yeah. Yeah, like a heart. Either way, it's going to give me diarrhea. Oh, for real? You still on camera. <laughs> anyway, it gave her diarrhea, but not me. I eat my eggs anyway. But listen, uh, we're going to go ride out this morning to support. Uh, we got Queen of the South and we got Buffalo Soldiers. And uh, I'm sure other uh, MC clubs will be there to help support this uh, community event. And that's what it's all about, us getting out together, uh, riding as one, going um, also to show support to those individuals that are essential to the jobs they do, you know, firefighters, you know, risk their lives every day as much as us do, but they do it in a very um, unique way. So we're just going to go out and uh, try to bless them with some food and um, go around and take some pictures with them, show them love, let them know that they are very supported in the community. And we really, really um, support what they do and what they are and who they are. Thank you. us out here about to go and deliver lunches to the firefighters okay. go ahead go what ahead you um 
Oh, we in Miami Gardens. Yes. <laughs> like, I don't even know what neighborhood we in. <laughs> and I am not even drinking yet. Oh, Lord, it's too early. <laughs> What you doing out here? Uh, Who are you? The, oh, I'm Inkaz, but the black sheep. Hi. Sorry. We are um, headed to... Oh, thank you. We love you too. I'm in love with y'all. Uh, <laughs> thank you. You know I work with? Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, so I you see y'all. us all the time. <laughs> love y'all back at you. Yes, <laughs> So you are, as we were saying, and I'm Angel Isaac, <laughs> president of Black Sheep. Uh, we are up here. We are up here today in Miami Gardens. We are uh, with uh, Living Free. We are going to deliver some uh, lunch to the firefighters in the neighborhood, just giving them love and support because we love what they do. And you're doing it on your what? Day off. <laughs> <laughs> on your Harley Davidson, girl, on your this, motorcycle. This ain't no Harley Davidson. Oh, you got a Honda. That's a Honda. Uh, um, this is Suzuki Boulevard. Oh, Suzuki. I don't know. I don't know my bike. <laughs> but that's my ride. <laughs> I, I don't know my shit. That's all. Good. It's <laughs> Look, good. all I know hey. is Harley. Oh, right. Oh, right. <laughs> yeah. right. I swear, I, I, I want. All right, y'all, breakfast is done, and we've made it to the gas station. Um, people are starting to roll in. Got a couple bikes that are here already. And, uh, you know, another event, another day in Miami, Florida. Another day, another day. here from Black Sheep. Um, I just want to let y'all know, March 30th, we are hosting um, a community health fair and a three-on-three -three basketball tournament. We want to see who got game. So what we're doing is we're helping the community stay healthy. 
We want, we're bringing out um, HIV trucks. We're doing um, cholesterol checks, blood pressure checks, diabetes checks, anything that you need, we got it. Um, my company, and we're doing a pain management. Anybody that got those back pains for being on those bikes, legs pain, we got you. Come on out, it's March 30th from 10 to 4 p.m. at Redeeming Word Christmas Center. It's a big field area. Bring your, your lawn chairs, your tents. We're gonna have a good time. There's food vendors. There's only gonna be other vendors that's be selling their special items. 2800 West Prospect Road, March 30th. This will be giving them um, along with the food. Okay, so tell us, you giving them what? Tell us so what this event is all about and what y'all doing. Why you doing that? Okay, Hearts on Fire ride. We're going to the fire station because we decided to give them something for Valentine's Day and show that we appreciate them for what they do. So for so that said, we're going to give them lunch as well as um, cupcakes for Valentine's, some cookies. And um, we ordered them something to hang in the fire station to show that we really appreciate everything that they do. And then from this event on, we're not just going to do fire station, firefighters. We're going to also do um, nurses, um, doctors, lawyers, anybody know any professional people, please let us know. And we will go to the uh, office building or whatever and donate lunch to them and give them a little something. So I did confirm that it is station number 26. Mm -hmm. She asked me, how did I know it was 26? Well, if she paid attention to the flyer, the flyer actually says station number 26. So like I said, I was just assuming it was station number 26, but I just confirmed it is station number 26.
made it to the firehouse, y'all. Yes, yes. We, oh. we made it to the firehouse. Who was that? You know where the park? Who that? Oh, that's part of the people with the food. Wow. So this is how we do it right here. Yeah, this is how we do it. We here. We're at the fire station. Okay, we'll come to there. He wants to come to it. Yeah, we'll come to the stuff out first. We'll come to the We got some meals. I didn't want to bother your hand was full. We got meals. Ooh, hot meals. Pasta. Mmm, yummy. See that? Yummy for your tummy. Hello. Is that the cupcake? Oh, cookies. Cookies. Look at that here. Cupcake. Look, I got the good stuff. I got the good stuff. All right, that's it. We're done. Get them in We need a cupcake to carry the cupcakes. All right. Get them in the got cupcake. We have some more back there. Uh, we have enough. Is that all them back there? Uh, I'm going to go real quick. Right back. I'll be right back. The rest of you, please make yourself at home. Okay. okay. Danny, right back. Hi, Hi, how you doing? I'm fine. How are you? Yes, ma'am. I'm good. Yeah, I'm, I'm good. Who's I'm Danny Palacio. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. All these names at the end of the day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you want to be tested? I'm yes, Queen Snapshot. Yes, ma'am. Queen, how you doing? Yeah, I'm good. Thank you. It yes, shouldn't be hard since all of us oh, got yeah, names right. on our vest. So you can remember. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, that's, I was like, do they remember yeah, me? Y'all yeah, yeah. gotta go real quick? Yeah, I think oh, they're the platform. Got a call, I think. Oh! oh. We gonna go inside, he said we're going inside. They got a call. They was looking for a little tour. Yeah, we'll do yeah. Yeah. Where the call at? Where the call at? Oh! Oh! Look at these. Oh, yeah. Where the call at? Y'all thinking the wrong thing. The poll is for emergencies, man. <laughs> they got a call. They did get a call. Okay. Oh, the call got canceled. Okay. Look at that. Nice. What are we going for? So how is that? We get. Oh, here you go. Thank y'all. We get here in the call. They got a call, and then the call got canceled. This is my first time, guys. First time. first time. We are popping cherries. I'm Queen Snapchat. I have a YouTube channel officially snapped. And our theme this year is popping cherries. What are we doing for the very first time? So, Cap, okay. you just popped my cherry. This is my very first time my inside honor. of a firehouse. It's my absolute honor to be able to do that. <laughs> Thank you so much. In so many ways. Yeah. <laughs> In so many ways. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. This is nice. Oh my god, I gotta turn the camera. So this is their little kitchen. This is this is the kitchen area. Wow. This is really good. Oh hey, how you doing? All right. Refrigerator area. So who's the chef? Everybody. Everybody's a chef. I love it. I love it. Oh, they still got breakfast on the stove. Yeah, yeah, we just uh, have breakfast a little late. It's all good. Got you some hot meals, guys. Thank you, thank you. No, thank you. It's our pleasure. You can't see them. No, don't offer us anything. So how long have you guys been on this? Uh, I've been on six years. Six years? Six years. And what, is, what, is, what has this done for you? What uh, made you want to be a fireman? What made me want to do it? Um, you look real young. How old are you? 32. Okay. Nice profession. Got your career yeah, 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 yeah. started young. I had an um, uncle who uh, was my, my role model. Okay. He was a firefighter. Nice. And he had me out a lot growing up, so I ended up following his profession. Nice. So <laughs> hopefully this is not my last time. We just stuff. came by to show you guys that we appreciate you and we thought that it wouldn't be right if we didn't present you guys with something for Valentine's Day because they always think about women. So we decided to do something for the men. I mean, if you had women fighting by tents, that's great, but 
I'm just trying to do something for the men. And sometimes, you know, what we do, we go on the appreciate. So we just want to say thank you. It's thank living you. free today, but we also have other riders with us. So it's going to be for all of us, actually. So we came by and brought you guys lunch. Brought you some cookies and some cupcakes. That's y'all Valentine's Day gift from each and every one of us. And that is, I hope everybody can eat it. Um, that is jerk chicken pasta. Oh, yeah. Love it. It's good. <laughs> <laughs> sure. And if I was Love you guys, it. I would dig in now, but we also want to present oh. you guys with this. I appreciate you very much. And hopefully, you guys can keep it around the oh. station. Yep, cat people need it. In the it. table, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ooh, thank you so much. Ooh. Thank you very much. Hey, I really, really appreciate you. That's nice. More than you all know, I appreciate it. Um, I've been here for five years. I was at Station 2 prior to this, Liberty City. I was in Little River. You know, I hope 29 your career. I've been in this area my whole career. So I truly, truly appreciate you. Very much. Very much. Welcome. This is your home. Welcome. Please drop by at any time. Please. I insist, you know, we have little um, memorabilia here from guys that were here way before me. We have a 9-11 memorial that uh, was erected on that corner right there from 9-11. Uh, All the guys that perished that day, uh, they're written on that table. So, uh, yeah, this is one of the oldest stations in the county. Yeah. Wow. A lot of tradition here over the years, so we really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. you This is what the life of a firefighter is. Listen, come over here. I am more than honored to have been invited into Station 26. Uh, this is great guys this is nice and i think it was an awesome idea for living free riders to put this together and as you heard um president blossom say earlier that this is she's not going to stop here um she's going to venture out when i say she i mean the club is going to venture out um they're going to do um any professional you know policemen lawyers teachers nurses anything of that nature because it's very important in the times that we're living in to let people know that you acknowledge them and that you appreciate them no matter how small or how big the job is we see you guys we see everything that everybody does and we just want to be able to give you just a little piece of hope or a little piece of acknowledgement no matter how small no matter how big so just take it run with it be thankful be appreciative be grateful thank you station 26 for allowing us to come here and bring you guys these things thank you I want to. Alright. I'm so childish. My first time. My first. Oh. Can't you get it up now? Whoa. Yo. I'm sweating just from getting up the steps. So I definitely got to give the props what props are due. If you have never had to, uh, how do I say, step up the uh, step of flights to get to a fire truck, baby. And I tell you, I'm sweating just by doing this, so I got to get mad props. I'm inside this truck, y'all. And this is, I mean, I don't even see how they function in here. You got to know what everything is at every time. This is, I want to be a firefighter now. I think I want to be a firefighter. Y'all, I'm out of breath. But this is nice. This is nice. I am, I swear I'm very appreciative of the opportunity because you really don't get to, and I don't even know the, the words to form right now because it's just, 
I am the driver. Um, you know, I made my way into the truck. You know how I do. I'm going to go the extra mile every single time. So I'm going to be up in the truck. I wish I could take y'all. I wish I could take y'all for a spin. <laughs> hey, you think they'll let me take this thing for a spin? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, no, this is nice. Um, I'm appreciative. I'm gonna walk around a little bit, get a couple of other things um, that are going on. Ooh, y'all felt me. I mean, it looks like you gotta get down. Like you really have to. I'm sure there's some type of method of getting down, huh? Guys, I'm just gonna get a couple, couple other uh, shots here. So we got our little practice dummy over here. Nobody had to see y'all. That's stuff like that. They had to pull them for the fire shot. That's the burning over here. Um, they keep the clothes, but it's open. I don't want to go in there. Got the little tools, all the little tools. You know, the department work with this stuff. Still, station number 26. You got the Metropolitan. Dade County, baby. Fire station 26. That's the stuff. Still representing. Still represent 26 over here. Oh, they got their grills. They got their grills back here. So I think they really, this is really true. What they say. This is their home. So I guess this is where they park. And they come in. And this, and they got their little music going on back here. They got the little workout station over here, little bicycle, the treadmill type of stuff and they want to work out. Little game plan area. We got the little couches, comfortable couches. Somebody out here smoking cigars. We got a little out here. Okay. This is where it's at. This is where it's at. Uh, pass away, I saw firefighters come in, uh, so that kind of was like the motivation. Okay, all right. But also, you know, I, I, I do want to become a doctor, Whoa. so there's like it's a lot of clinical skills that I learned from this. Nice, nice, Jonathan. Guys, this is Jonathan. Hi. He is a, a training student. How do you say? Yes, training student. He's a training student. And how long have you been here? Here? Oh, this is actually my first day. This is, this is actually first... my first day. Yes. Yeah, so. Another first. Very, very Another good. first. Very, very Another first. So listen. This is his first day. We came here on his first day. He's doing what he loves to do, which is giving back, helping, save people. And then we're doing what we love to do, which is riding motorcycles and then showing gratitude to the people in our community. So how great is that, that he was able to be a part of that on his very first yeah, day? Yeah, that, that was truly special. I, and I've never seen that. Like we went on the wow. two calls and I saw this. I feel like it, I'm never gonna forget this memory. Oh. But I never won't, so I like, really appreciate that. Oh my God, that is so great, guys. And listen, a lot of the things that even yourself will do, you will never, ever forget. The people that you come and encounter with. And guys, again, it's not what you, it's not what what you say to people or what you do is what they what they remember you by. So he'll always be able to remember South Florida motorcyclists as coming on his very first day on his internship externship yes, yes. on his internship at Firehouse. Wow! Thank you, my yeah, brother. No Congratulations! You know, hope all is well. We're praying for you. I mean, even when you graduate, invite us back to the graduation no because we would love to show up to your graduation in numbers, just to let you know how proud we are of you and to keep going. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Oh, okay. That is awesome, guys. Thank you so much. That is, that is great. Let's back up. Oh no, I don't want to do it. Come on, come on.
on. Come on. Come on, six year vet. Tell us your name. My name is Brian Ferguson. Oh, Brian Ferguson. We already know he's been here six years. Okay. What else you want to know? Uh, how did you start? How did I start? I said I had an uncle who was a firefighter. He had an uncle that was a firefighter, that's right. He, he pushed me to do this and it worked out for us. I was like 32 years old. I fly when I was 25. This is my first department and my last department. First? First and last? Why would it be your last? Uh, because there's nothing wrong with Miami-Dade. Okay. Miami-Dade has a lot of opportunities for expansion and growth, so I like it here. So how is this number? How, this, it says that this is the oldest station. Captain said this was one of the oldest stations. One of the oldest stations. Okay, one of the oldest stations. So now I heard this is I heard recently because I have a, a guy that is a, I have a friend guy um, that is fire. A shout out to my boy in Little Rock who's watching this video. Now he told me that uh, the numbers represent how many stations are in the count. Yes. So there are 26 stations in. No, so Miami-Dade County as a whole has two different departments. We have City of Miami, Miami-Dade County, uh -huh. okay. Miami-Dade, but for Miami-Dade, Metro Bay, we have all 70 stations. 70? Oh, so this is considered Metro Dade. Okay, this is considered Metro Dade. Okay, that's why I was looking for Miami-Dade, County, all the same. Oh, so it is one of the oldest. If it's number 26 and they got 77. My lord. We go all the way from Sunny Isles all the way to Man, look at that. Little history. Ain't nothing wrong with learning every day. You see that? I've been living for 40 plus years. And I'm learning something new today. <laughs> so, thank you. O'Brien. O'Brien, y'all. Station 26. Station 26. First and last station. Okay. Proper way to wear this stuff like this okay and this is a what they call this a sledgehammer this is a sledgehammer so this would be like if you need to break a window or a door oh walls this is more for walls this thing heavy lord have mercy i could lift this 30 times and get a little Okay, what we got here? The Halligan. A Halligan. A Halligan. A Halligan. First time y'all never heard that word before Halligan. in my life. That's, that's for doors. This is for doors. Halligan. This is for doors. So, I mean, I've seen this before. I just didn't know what it was called. The axe. We got an axe. So these things are really heavy. So now I really know what it means when they say you have to go through the training. You have to have the strength. You have to have the knowledge of how to properly hold these things and how to properly engage when you are at a difficult situation. So these are, oh, my arms are gonna hurt. My arm's starting to hurt, y'all. This thing is so heavy. Wow. I've never held a real axe before in my life. I promise, this is my very first time holding an axe. <laughs> now that I got this training, y'all don't try me. Don't try me. I might have to become a fire, a fire, a fire. Do y'all have ladies here? Yeah, ladies. Uh, not today, but we will have ladies come here. Oh, they got a young lady tomorrow. Might have to come back tomorrow just to visit them. So y'all, I got my little gear on. It is kind of heavy. And it does feel very sturdy. I do, I do feel very secure. I don't know how to feel if I run through a fire. Well, we're not going to try it. We're not gonna figure, we're not gonna find out today how it would be if I ran through a fire, but this is pretty cool. Boy, I gotta come up out of this thing.
Oh my god. Listen guys, I just want to close this video. I want to say thank you to Living Free Riders and everybody that participated in this event. This was an awesome event. Thank you to the firemen at Station 26 in Miami-Dade County. This was definitely a memorable moment. I will never, ever, ever forget this moment. And again, always remember, like the videos, share the videos, and make your comments down below. Guys, go out and do something special. Uh, like my pastor always say, be blessed, but most importantly, be a blessing. So enjoy the rest of your weekend. We are signing out, heading out, and 